hey guys welcome back for another video and in today's video we are going to compare the three kings by the three brands and all the three brands are really successful in their respective fields okay so the three brands are the oneplus the samsung and the xiaomi okay so we are going to compare three of the latest mega flagship phones today and you might, might have guessed that these are the oneplus 8 pro the Galaxy S20 Ultra and the Mi 10. Okay, so if the Mi Note 10 or the Mi 10 Pro had launched today, we could have compared them as well. But since it's not yet time for their launch, so we are not going to compare them now. Although we know their features, but still. So instead of wasting more time, we are going to compare the three. Okay, so I'm gonna give you a better view of this okay so first we are going to talk about the oneplus 8 pro the oneplus 8 pro has a 6.67 inch fhd plus amoled display a good 120 hertz refresh rate a snapdragon 865 up to 12 gb ram it has a 48 mp plus 48 mp quad camera it has a 16 mp front punch hole camera it has a good 4510 mah battery it has a warp or wireless charge 30t which is very good and it's priced at 55,000. So these features are quite good if you see about if you talk about OnePlus they offer um, good phones at a lesser price than the other brands like Samsung. So let's come to Samsung now which has executive awesome features but too much overpriced. Okay so let's see their features. Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra features a 6.9 inch AMOLED QHD plus display. A very brilliant 120Hz refresh rate and Exynos 990 processor which is equal to the speed of the Snapdragon 865. It is it has up to 16 GB RAM, it has a 108 MP quad camera, it has a best in class 40 MP front punch hole camera, it has a brilliant 5000 mAh battery and a brilliant even more brilliant 45 watt fast charging. It's priced at 92k that is 92,000 it is too overpriced but it's still a good option if you are a money spender on phones okay so now let's move on to our last phone here which is the mi10 which features decent specs as well 6.67 inch fhd plus amoled display a good 90 hertz refresh rate a snapdragon 865 up to 8 gb ram 108 mp quad camera 20 mp front punch hole camera good 4780 mAh battery 30 watt wired as well as wireless charging and it's the cheapest phone if you compare it with the three it's priced at 49999 that is 50000 it just launched two days back and it's the it's a better phone for me if you compare it with oneplus 8 pro that's what we are going to compare first okay so we will compare the oneplus 8 pro versus the mi10 now the oneplus 8 pro i mean first we are going to talk about what the oneplus 8 pro has better than the mi10 the oneplus 8 pro has a better refresh rate okay a better up to gb ram and nothing else it has better than mi10 i see okay so these are the two extra things that oneplus 8 pro has than mi10 and if you want to buy oneplus 8 pro you can but um, i would recommend you the mi10 instead so okay first let us see now what the mi10 has in more offer than the one nor oneplus 8 pro the mi10 has a curved display this you can see the curved display which oneplus 8 doesn't have um, it has a 108 mp quad camera which oneplus 8 doesn't have it has a 20 mp front punch hole camera which oneplus 8 has only 16 mp it has a better battery which is 4780 mah it has a wired and wireless charge which is also the same here it's 5000 less priced so that's a very good point here okay so we can easily understand the mi10 is better than the oneplus 8 pro now we are going to compare the oneplus 8 pro versus the galaxy s20 ultra and then the galaxy s20 ultra versus the mi10 and then again compare which is the best phone and which is the second best phone among these three okay so watch this video till end and don't go anywhere okay so the first we are going to compare the oneplus 8 pro versus the galaxy s20 ultra and let's see one plus what one plus h pro has better than the galaxy s20 ultra okay so we can easily understand that the one plus eight pro has nothing better than the galaxy s20 ultra but the galaxy s20 ultra easily leads and with what it leads we are going to talk about that now 
first let us zoom a bit and okay now we can easily see it okay so the galaxy s20 ultra leads in a bit bigger display and a and same display but a bigger display um one uh, the galaxy s20 ultra has a better up to gb ram and it has a better cameras 108 mp camera 40 mp front punch hole camera better battery better fast charge and a better price i mean a bigger price okay it's too overpriced if galaxy s20 ultra would be available at 65000 or 70000 then it could be the best phone of 2020 probably okay so we can understand that the oneplus 8 4 does not stand in front of the galaxy s20 ultra okay now we are going to compare the mi 10 versus the galaxy s20 ultra okay so the galaxy s20 ultra versus the mi 10 now we are going to compare these the mi 10 has a curved display which is not present in the galaxy s20 ultra unfortunately but the galaxy s20 ultra has a bigger display that's a good point it has a better refresh rate it has the same processor it is better up to ram it has a better better both cameras are better actually because mi10 has 108 mp plus 20 mp camera whereas whereas galaxy s20 ultra has the 108 mp plus 48 mp camera and it also has a better front punch hole camera which is 40 mp it also has a better battery better fast charge and a bigger price but if you compare the mi10 is so less priced than if you can go for the mi10 i highly recommend you the mi10 but if you are a money spender as i already told you or a big fan of samsung you can easily easily go for the galaxy s20 ultra because it is worth it but if the but wait for some time let the price drop a bit and then you can easily go for it so now we are going to compare the overall three phones okay so the one plus eight pro I'm gonna say that the OnePlus 8, I'm gonna eliminate OnePlus 8 Pro from this round now because the OnePlus 8 Pro is, hasn't, does not have anything which is better than the MI10. I mean the Galaxy S20 Ultra and so the Galaxy S20 Ultra wins in this video and the second is MI10 and the third is the OnePlus 8 Pro. Okay, now we are going to say that if you, if you are planning to buy a flagship phone of the budget segment i mean no, sorry, not the budget segment of the 50k rupees segment then i would highly recommend you the mi10 you can easily easily go for the mi10 it's worth every penny a really good phone okay but if you are a fan of oneplus and a fan of show off or something like that or you hate trend me or something like that which is mostly common then you can go for the oneplus 8 pro okay but normally i recommend you the mi10 very good phone but if you have lots of lots of money if you are rich as ambani then you can definitely buy the galaxy s20 ultra because it's the best phone okay so this was what we had to talk about in this video hope you liked it and enjoyed it and do like share subscribe and comment and share it to your friends who love this type of phones and tell them bye bye and i will be back with my next video soon so hope you like this video and do like share also i already told you and due to the problems regarding in this world right now we would recommend you to stay home and stay safe and stay healthy so okay goodbye and if you want to talk to me or chat to me you can always by seeing typing this, these words in instagram and you can do a direct message me on instagram and i can talk to you if you have any problems queries or anything like that and so bye until then stay tuned